Your girl is a Taurus sun. Focus on your peace, moving forward. If it shows up half-baked, half-cooked, half-made, half-ready, release it. Period. Stop forcing shit that's no one. Ain't gonna hold nobody. Ain't gonna fake shit, ain't gonna hold shit, ain't gonna make shit up. I love what I do. Cause I'm tap the fuck in. I'ma read this motherfucking course yeah. left, right, up, down, sideways, sideways. Tap the fuck in. You hear me? Yeah, I read Mirror it. two. Tap the fuck Backwards in. Backwards in reverse. Yeah. I'ma read these bitches. Hello, my members only. Thank you for joining this channel. Thank you for your support. Let's see. What does the universe have for you all at this time? Anything you need to know about me, as you know, is down below. I hope you all are well. And happy birthday to any Aries. Taurus, we are up next for any of you here in the members only tab or community board. For members only, angels, spirit guides, and ancestors. What's the tape? What is going on? For the members only, please. We got main female. So for you women, you're focusing more on yourself and your life. There could be a main female that is showing up in a dynamic or a particular situation could be a mother could be a boss could be a sister could be your person dealing with a main female for you men put yourself in those same exact situations or scenarios that i just mentioned there could be a main female in your life that you are focusing on or that is like really a priority at this time whether you want her to be or not let's see what else for that is card number two so she does have a partner the main male number one so could be a connection something going on here she has a rose in her hand so someone could definitely be wanting to give you your flowers for you women for you men vice versa same thing there's a female you are definitely honing in on let's see someone gets a lot of flowers someone could uh have access to uh oh someone is definitely getting fired too or they stop working on something someone has low low maintenance here with themselves here Hold on, I don't want to pick up too much here. Someone could have access to like um, this is looking like the Oval Office if you really look at it, like some kind of politician or um, high ranking or someone's dating their boss. It's something going on with the way that this office is designed. Um, and those flowers there, it looks like this person receives a lot, receives a lots of flowers. Someone could want to give you your flowers or you to this person. But yeah, it looks like a very important office. So this could be work-related for some of you. Uh, giving some kinky stuff. Someone having access to a very high-ranking authority figure here. Hmm. But they could have gotten fired with toil and labor here at the bottom of the... Uh, not at the bottom of the day. What's at the bottom of the day? M message of concern. <laughs> Spirit say bottom of the day. Message of concern, child. Shit. And there ain't no but women here. This a lady right here. This a lady and this a lady. Shit, nah. Someone could have lost their job or they're tired of working on something. They're tired of working for this relationship with this lady or this is huge. They could have fired her. One and four breaks down to a five here with 14. Someone's birthday could be on the 14th. I'm hearing as well. Okay. The 14th of any month. Yeah, but that one and five breaks down to a change. Um... The one and four breaks down to five, which is the number of change. Message of concern. This whatever message or email or text she got definitely shook things up. But let's see. Well, this is you. What else for the members only? What is going on? Community. This is giving work or friendship circle or um colleagues. I'm here. We're going to clarify. This could be someone they're living with. They could be worried about what people think in their community. Some of you are doing something in humanity or a community here. But something is um imbalanced here in the workplace. Toil and labor is working on something or hard work not being paid off uh, properly. It's giving overwork and underpaid. Someone quit too in order to do something in humanity. Someone, ooh, okay, I like that. Somebody quitting a job in order to do something in humanity with this community. It could also be a divorce, too. Some papers were served. You could be getting some kind of inheritance. Uh, some of you could be getting some kind of tax money here to do something in humanity. But for some of you, someone got fired. I just got a notification. I have one, two, three on my clock, too. So that could be relevant. Taking the right steps. It says, do not touch the stairs in the woods. Oh, okay whatever that mean <laughs> i'm like her okay message of concern <laughs> wow message of 
concerned and concerned. Listen, something going on here. I'm about to get teary eyed. There, I feel like there are two people, that, two people that are on the same page. This could also be a parenting situation where someone's concerned about their kid. This male and female are both concerned. Okay, this masculine and feminine about the same thing in a family dynamic for some of you. And it got something to do with work or school or organization. There go that main male. It's all connected. Oh, Lord. Let's see what this is. Shit, it's getting good. <laughs> is the tea don't touch the stairs in the woods it's giving is that hamsel and gretel like where you got like you go into the woods and there's like a house or some kind of structure lord have mercy little red riding hood i think she got she had a little cabin in the hood in the, in the hood <laughs> in the woods let me get uh get going with this read y'all forgive me what else <laughs> for the collective members only I'm hollering. Courthouse. Despair. Coffin. What? Ain't no way. No. The, I, I, this whole deck that flipped over. No. Change. Give. Great fortune. Okay. Somebody died and there was an inheritance. There was a divorce. A prenuptial agreement for somebody here. This horizon not even making plans. They've been thinking about somebody they treated poorly, bad health with the lovers. Oh my goodness, there was a child involved. They stayed in a family dynamic because of the child. Someone aborted the child after sneaking around and got pregnant. Someone tried to get pregnant on purpose or they lied about a child. That was found out as well. Someone got pregnant while someone was in jail in order to receive money. Someone died and something showed up in court like on a wheel that really revealed something, despair. Someone lost a lot. Someone died and the inheritance did not go to who they thought it was going to go to with unexpected income, despair, coffin, courthouse. Listen, I can handle a whole flip over, but spirit, let's not. Mm -mm. Damn. What else? I don't even know how that happened. I'm going to have to watch it back. Marriage sideways with great fortune sideways. Spirit said these cards is coming out and bad health show back up. Well, let's clarify because y'all ain't finna give me no movie to read. <laughs> we not doing that. I've been here all day. Entertained, by the way, because Lord have mercy. It's one thing to be truly, truly, truly psychic because sometimes it can be overwhelming, child. It can be up in everybody's business with all the tea. <laughs> Chris Brown, Tory Lanez. Uh, Chris Brown is a Taurus. Tory Lanez is a Leo. The song on is Take You Down, the Take Remix. From Chinks Take Five, Five is Change. Child, listen, something going on, Take You Down. Ooh, Lord, somebody going down for their crimes, bad hell. Main female. Seriously, I ain't getting these cards good enough shuffle. All right, let's get it. Somebody sick, child. Look at this three of swords energy right here with bad health. Mm -mm. Oh, they hurt. This deck is still new spirit. How y'all gonna make me shuffle? All right. <laughs> let's go. Let's get it. Okay, 10 of wands, something is a burden. Toil and labor, that would be a burden. Be overworked and underpaid. <clears throat> Main female, four, members only. What's that? The king of cups and the devil. Hold on, y'all. <laughs> uh -uh. Okay, there's a male here that's obsessed with this lady. Mm -hmm. Trying to block and stop somebody from doing something, from having some great fortune and marriage sideways. Oh, Lord. There go my giggles, because somebody on that bullshit. There's a main female stuck with a karmic partner. Or a main male stuck with his karmic partner. These two has been, they've been fumbling here. Fondling around with, with King Lucifer, Satan, morning star, the devil, child. Oh, uh, spirit. I don't want to 
gonna jump to conclusions, but my spidey senses is tingling. Somebody obsessed with the nine of cups and the in the devil. Capricorn Pisces it might be a Scorpio, I almost said Scorpio. Cancer Scorpio Pisces with their King of Cups. I feel it's giving Scorpio. Okay. What's going on with this? Hold on, y'all, because I'm going to get it. If you subscribe to my channel, you know I'm going to figure it out. What's this? King of Pentacles. It's two men. Out of, the, out of this lady is cheating. This King of Cups came out with the devil. He in partnership. He trying to stop this King of Pentacles from getting to this main female. It's giving a scoring ex that don't want you to move forward for you women or for, for you men. This could be blocking your connection with a specific lady or you this devil energy. Okay. I hope you ain't subscribed to my channel with it. Go on now. All right. Yeah. There could be a lady dating a married man too. And she has her own significant other. What's another scenario? A whole lot of sex. Page of Wands, Ace of Wands, a whole lot of potential newness. The devil always in the mix now. Uh, hold on. We got two men here. I'm going to come back to that. What's Toil and Labor? See if I can come up with another scenario or uncover one. Let me tell you what I'm feeling. I feel like there's somebody blocking you from coming together with someone. Marriage sideways, great fortune sideways. They're obsessed with you or you're obsessed with this person or they're obsessed with the person you want to be with. That's an obsession here. This King of Cups could also be fearing opening up too. He could be very materialist, very superficial. He wants to spoil you, but there's an obsession. I don't like this devil energy. So I'm going to come back. Otherwise, I say, look like there's a lady that has two men on her arms, or there's a man here that's falling in love with someone, and they want to take care of them. But the devil's there, so we gonna hold on. Toil and labor. Well, oh, that bitch doing magic. Mm -hmm. The moon. I don't like the moon and the devil showing up in the same read. Oh, we about to hit. It's a new moon tomorrow. Shit, we already in the energy. How much energy we got? Mm. Child, we in a new moon energy. We in a low. We in a low numbers on percentage, between eight and two percent. New moon. Here we go. Why is this toil and labor in reverse? Somebody is repressing some kind of emotions. It's giving fear, deceit. I got two cards that can embody fear: the moon and the devil. But it more, it's more so likely the inner inner darkness like shadow so subconscious what's the moon with the toil and labor in reverse pisces cancer energy page of swords somebody's watching observing there's that nine of cups again somebody's obsessed uh-uh what's this shit right here before I assume the worst. Let's say I use my other deck that I never use. Okay. What treats are in here? What's this devil energy? Can I shuffle like this? Seeking pleasure. Oh shit. What's this devil energy? The warrior of love, standing alone, a beautiful face, ideal romance. That person is obsessed with this with this lady, or you're obsessed with this lady. Period. There's an obsession. It's like ideal lover, physical attraction. They're obsessed. Ideal romance. Warrior of love. It's like they want to fight for it. They won't release it. They won't let it go. What's the moon? Or oh, that lady obsessed with that person. Somebody is obsessed and they're they're taking extreme measures to keep something. Mm -mm, the moon. Taking a plunge. Yeah, somebody's losing themselves. Because the moon, one of the definitions is losing one's way. 
taking a plunge in water the moon is water this person is diving deep in water i feel like they're hitting rock bottom or they got fired or something or whatever they're doing whatever evil eye, whatever negative energy whatever they're looking into is not panning out the way that they want the uncertainties are heavy this un person's unconscious mind is weighing heavy on it they could have quit their job they could have lost their job okay they unstable unrequited desire you don't want it or the person that they're obsessed with don't want them or this person don't want you however it go yeah this person is obsessed child oh lord this could be a male or a female what's community page of swords is gathering info stalking watching what's community what is this page of cups naive Somebody about to come and take that fish too. Justice. Look at this seagull about to take that fish up out that cup. So some of you could have been naive, showing off, or gullible, or this is them. Yeah. Inner child. Inner child community. One more. They got a family with this person. What else? Empress and the Eight of Cups. To the left, to the left, to the left. Six of swords, she moved away and walked away, but they got a child together. Oh, my God. Why does resonate? Child, listen. <sighs> Some of y'all are done with a relationship. Some of y'all, y'all person was done with a relationship. But that person can't seem to let go or they have some kind of connection. Some of you are going to have to walk away from things that you thought you knew, everything that you stood on, uh, everything you built upon community and go your own way and try something new some kind of creativity or endeavor or follow your heart with this page of cups eight of cups and walk away from what is no longer serving some of you who is this empress six of swords death fool to the six of cups what the fuck this is heavy i feel like this empress is moving forward trying to get away from something from her past eight of swords to the six of cups that kept her stuck but somebody trying to do magic magician two of cups to the queen of pentacles this is an ex or somebody they married to or someone you're married to or in a long-term relationship with trying to do magic to keep them stuck or there's someone trying to come into partnership with you but someone keeps keeping them stuck someone from their past it's like they jump in and out of this fool to the death, fool to the death, fool to the death to the six of swords. They keep trying to come towards you, but someone trying to keep them stuck. What the fuck? What's this empress? Mm -mm. Let me separate this. What's the empress? The empress is love secret. That's Venus energy. Could also have been a mistress. The empress put herself in a mistress position. Someone cheated on this empress. Or someone's secretly in love and obsessed with this empress and she walked away. Ugh. Eight of Cups. Longing and desire. The game of love. Listen, uh-uh. <laughs> the devil. Longing and desire, the Eight of Cups. Somebody is getting redundant. Someone walked away. Or they're trying to. And someone's trying to keep them stuck. The game of love. The warrior of love. Like, they really want to fight for this. But it's Empress. The fuck? Y'all could be in the same spiritual community. Community. Y'all could have uh, mutual friends and or family. Or this is what's going on in someone else's life that you're connected to. Somebody keeps trying to keep them stuck. Or get them back. Or take their abundance. <laughs> wow that what i ain't never seen a reading so redundant i ain't never gave a reading so redundant what's this one what's marriage spirit one more there's a male here on the verge of a breakup a separation three of swords to the king of swords He's going through a divorce for some of you. Some of y'all, this is someone from your past that misses you. For some of you, there's some kind of uh, angelic protection over this separation. It's not of, um, ooh, I just heard something judicial-like. 
it's not damn it slipped my mind it was something like it's not of authenticity like it's not an actual separation it was done by manipulation through your swords a love spell for some of you or someone caused a separation between you and a, a spiritual spouse damn i got the king of cups the king of swords the king of pentacles there's a whole lot of men involved to be honest these all these kings can be angelic beings archangel Raphael, archangel michael um is that gabriel the archangel of um mm -mm, i gotta look up his rank i should know but i feel like there's a whole lot of protection around this divine connection interesting gabriel is truth i believe he's a fifth shock throat chakra emotional intelligence too oh shit let me not get too deep child why is this marriage sideways seven of, <laughs> i'm sorry for the, for the side the seven of wands is stand your ground protection defense fight for something overcoming obstacles and challenges on this card this person is praying i have leo energy and i have tory lanes back on the on the tv with the song to dream and he's a leo the album is titled i told you so I feel like somebody has been fighting for something or there's a need to fight for something, this connection for some of you or this archangel energy here is fighting for this marriage to come together. Or this person has been really trying to fight for a relationship or a situation that has not been working, marriage for once. For some of you, this is a twin flame and there's been some kind of external demonic devil blockages from y'all coming together. That's why I have all of these avenging angels on my table. It is getting spooky. Spirit, am I right, like, with that scenario? Like, is there an angelic presence protecting a connection? Like, what's this? Because I feel a little kooky. Ace of Pentacles. Sideways. That's one scenario. What's the Ace of Pentacles and why is it sideways? Opportunities. As soon as I thought it. Closing cycles. There's more to the story. A lot of lessons to be learned in addition to somebody trying to block and stop. Okay, someone's just trying to stop a connection from closing out because they're obsessed with it with the devil as well. The world. Ace of Pentacles, hit me one more time. That's opportunity and abundance. Potential. Someone's also trying to take your stuff. Oh, okay. Ace of Pentacles. For my question to am I right? Nine of Cups. Someone's trying to block your successes. Take your stuff. Everything that you worked hard for in addition to block this connection, which can be connected. Queen of Wands. They miss you with the Five of Cups right behind that. Or someone's doing black magic. Queen of Wands, Moon, and the Devil showing up in the same reading as well child listen so i asked my team was i correct about a connection being blocked yes partially in addition to your abundance and successes nine of cups to the ace of pentacles that's why there's oof that's why there's a heavy angelic presence here uh, who's the culprit it's that king of cups that came out with the devil yep and he's working with someone three of cups but you're also a partner with spirit. There's a third party. He's a third party in this connection. So if you're the male watching, your person is caught up with a karmic partner devil to the king of cubs that's trying to block or stop them. In my case, it resonates for me. I'm transparent enough to say that. I have an ex that's a cancer that's trying to block and stop a whole lot in my life. There's been a whole lot of angelic uh, stuff going on in my life. So that's why I'm able to resonate with this reading and properly distribute it deliver it and relay it but i will never project my shit that's why i ask spirit am i right because i would never want to just put my story out there as as y'all's truth but i am right 
block some of y'all are going through the same shit that's why y'all resonate with me block y'all's path block somebody from coming towards you and block your successes there's somebody jealous now if it's not on your side it's on somebody that you're connected to spiritually side period or you could be cross watched for someone that you know like yeah someone that you're connected to there's some kind of external third party interference here and that's why there's a heavy angelic presence some of you have a choice between two men for you women some of you men you you've been in the middle of some okay and that relationship has to close out third party to the world nine of cups someone has to fight for their wishes or really go towards whatever it is that they're truly desiring but it's all of this is connected to only the strong survive strength part um what are you willing to fight for where's your resilience um where's your courage and confidence in regards to making the right decisions to move forward or getting away from this demonic stronghold here makes sense that all of these angelic beings shows up for the devil though this is a tricky spirit or being entity what's the great fortune sideways Somebody, it came out right here when i was asking who's who's who and who's doing what am i right someone's trying to block your successes and your relationship great fortune sideways but what is the great fortune sideways the emperor and the emperor's up the, 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 yeah yeah Coming together with your emperor, coming together with your empress is the great fortune. They're trying to block your emperor though, or you're the emperor being blocked from getting towards your divine feminine because she may be caught up with a masculine energy in her energy. Like he may be trying to block you energetically or literally they together, they stay together or vice versa. Some of you women, your masculine is being blocked because of your exes or the person they with period empress came out in the community perhaps she does something in humanity okay the emperor is your great fortune or you're this person's great fortune once y'all come together something has to be let go of now listen now what's this death and the fool what's bad health at the bottom of the deck some of you your great fortune is starting your own business your own empire but it's sideways so either get to work remove your obstacles but please understand that there's something angelic going on here and there's a battle too because angels show up for a reason. So it has something to do with your wealth or your person's wealth. Bad health. <laughs> Whew, how is that good news, spirit? Okay, yeah somebody's been doing a whole lot of work somebody's ex queen and king of cups my child's father child's mother a whole lot of work sending a whole lot of energy hostilities trying to change the course of events they're getting rejected they're going to get bad news good news is death <laughs> what they thought they wanted they're not getting negativity lonely not hopeful energy i'm telling you cancer energy with that four cups aquarius five of swords taurus scorpio leon aquarius will of fortune eight of pentacles is virgo energy <laughs> i'm sitting here chuckling because i'm like spirit i don't understand how is that good news the page of wands is good news i don't know why that's bad hell somebody's obsessed with this feminine energy an ex of hers or somebody that she's with and or has a child with or this is you i'm not playing the lovers with the with the child and and, and, and they're trying to steal something thief okay we gonna so your wives bad health good news are you gonna get it okay we're done <laughs> post this this is going to be a collective reading i'm gonna let y'all watch it first members only i am going to let y'all watch this first child listen all this shit <laughs> i'm about to cry excuse me 
all the shit I just set up here and say about angels and demons and exes and <sighs> spirit. <laughs> when y'all blunt like this, it really takes me for a loop. Like, really throws me. Spirits say bad health is good news because this two of cups is coming together. I clarified and got, I will find my way back to you one day, no matter what. <laughs> the bad health is good news so that the two of you can come together. This is a collective reading. Spirit and a new passion to begin. What is the bad health? Is that is it can that can, can that be any of our business? How does bad health show up? What is it? Is it a disease? Is it death? Is it what what's the bad health? Broken home, loss of stability, whoever they've been partnered with. A divorce, a loss of their spiritual inheritance because the four of wands can be ancestral, um, ancestral connections like your fourth house. Damn. And then I have the magician and the eight of swords, spiritual jail. How else does bad health show up? Got a lack of stability, broken relationship. You don't even give up when they start losing everything. You moving forward, a maternal figure in their life being ill. What if? How does this bad health show up? The Six of Pentacles, you having support, getting accolades, people giving you money, people paying for your services. Uh, you getting financial support from them, them having to pay you money. Okay, last card. Child support, splitting of assets, something here they're going to have to pay you or you're going to have to pay this person. However it go. How does bad health show up? Because sometimes, sometimes people cross watch. Last card. How does bad health show up for this person? Your <laughs> spirit, <laughs> spirit is being discreet. Things will be stagnant in this person's life. They will have to surrender. More than likely be in jail. There will also be many sacrifices made um, for the conflict that they've caused and have blocked, caused chaos in your life, your spiritual inheritance, your ancestors are pre present to protect you from all of this chaos and conflict. Any delays in your life as well is going to be mirrored back to them. There's also going to be a marriage. But I feel like with that two of cups, I'll find my way back to you. This is part of your spiritual inheritance. They can't block that. They shouldn't have been able to interfere in your life in any way. Some of you have become more keen in your path on how to protect yourself. So on and so forth. Let me not get too deep. But I said, how does this bad health show up for this person? You're being guided to move forward no matter what. And that's going to make them sick. That will be their silent killer for a lot of you. And spirit says, because the six of swords is also spirit, guys. Let's just focus on you moving forward. Let's not worry about them or their karma. And this is my cue. Peace.